This video is for Kevin and Richard. Uh, my name is Galia and in, in this video I'm going to show you three things you can do today to help bring in more customers to your business. So by the end of this video you liked what you heard, shoot me a message back and we can chat. If not, it's okay with me. Uh, so now let me show three things that will set your company above your competition. The first thing I want to go over is content. Uh, you uh, need more content on your home page. Uh, at least 1500 or more uh, because we will love content also make sure you have uh, right keywords and pictures saved the correct way as well the second thing I want to talk about is a citation so if you come here you're gonna see the Google guaranteed ads then you can see this normal ads and then um, we see the map back so uh, what is the citation it is essentially your business name, address, and the phone number listed in uh, various directories all throughout the web. It's basically, to put it simply, yellow pages, Facebook, LinkedIn, any of those places online that allow business owners to add their business details and services within there uh, would be considered like a directory or business directory listing. And in order to rank high on, um, on these maps here, you need to make sure that you are looking at your competition's directory listing and seeing what they are currently being listed in and you want to try to go out and get yourself listed in there as well uh, so but you don't want to just stop there you you want to add a little bit more so that way you are completely dominating them in that space and that will help you rank well here in, in the search now we already covered content and citation and last thing i want to cover is is the backlinks and so that has a lot to do with this organic section on down here and as you see this is Yelp this um, expertise the home advisors um, these are a lot of big national companies that uh, are taking up the top of the page the way backlinks work all it means is that there a website uh, out there that has a link to your website and that link to your website could potentially bring some traffic from that other website. So um, backlinks are not always created equal. So if you have, you know, for example, an ice cream shop that you um, had you send you link, you did some work and you did a good job and they send you link. But they all whole websites all about ice cream shops and ice cream stuff. It's not going to do it as much good for you as, let's say, another uh, HVAC company. A lot more effective when you have a relative site linking to you. That's going to be a little bit more powerful because it's more unique and relevant to your industry. So looking at uh, one of my this, um, tools down here, it's called AREFs. <laughs> uh, it's not 100% accurate, but it's one of these companies that uh, buys data from Google. And so it gives me an idea of what's working well for you and what's working well for your competition as well. And as I see here, you have 13 referring domains that brings you 61 backlinks. And out of those, those backlinks you have found um, in 19 keywords. And out of those keywords, you're getting 52 people on average on your site each month. Just to show you the, the, the um, one of your competitors here, see they have 713 referring domains. That um, brings them more than 3,000 um, backlinks, and they're getting found in more than 26,000 keywords. And all those keywords, they have they're getting more than 26,000 uh, people on average on their site each month. So. Uh, to boost these numbers is very doable and we specialize in that. Um, so that's pretty much it what I had for today and I hope this video has been educational for you. If you would like to know more about how NYC marketers can help grow your business online, please give me a call and we can chat. If not, no worries, enjoy the free tips I've given today. If you could just give me some feedback uh, on this video and let me know how I did. And thanks again and have a great day.